All right, so I was planning to head over to the camp and then just kind of, you know, rip around on the, the Kauai Cat and maybe do a little scouting. And then I remembered that about five years ago, I left um, I left a barrel, like a bait barrel for bear hunting in the, in the woods somewhere. And I had all intentions of using it and baiting a spot and, and uh, hunting there. And then I completely forgot about it. So I got... I'm trying to find barrels to, to set up and apparently they're not as easy to find as they used to be. So I uh, I just collect kind of thing on the way out. So I'm going to uh, rip in there real quick and see if it's still there. I brought bolt cutters and and um, a couple other tools to see if I can get the chain off the tree. Because if it is sitting there, it's probably fairly stuck. But um, we're going to uh, we're going to give it a try. See if we can if we can get it if it's gone good at least it wasn't sitting in the woods for the last five years if not probably even better because like i said it's getting getting difficult to find barrels <sighs> unreal it's here though. <laughs> oh man, oh man, oh man. There it is. Just like that, it wasn't that bad. I thought it was gonna be rusted, um, but luckily I brought everything I needed just in case, but we're good. That was just too easy. So I'm assuming something's gonna go wrong here later on in the day. to the camp and he to stash his barrel and then we're gonna go for a rip on the bike and see and see what the trails like on the bike anyway I haven't been down there yet we're gonna scout a bit and see if we can find uh, a spot or two that I probably wouldn't have hunted if I didn't have the bike since there's no four-wheeler access um, it's a long hike <laughs> Like we were doing 21 kilometers a day last season and it's just getting ridiculous. So gonna try uh, gonna try the bike down the trail. Alright. Well mater. It's definitely interesting riding a bike through the woods like that. We'll go for a stroll and see if we can uh, find some find some sign and maybe find a spot to hunt a little bit this season, early season anyway. Well, they're not too far in and we made our first find. It's not really what I'm looking for. Um, it's kind of a, one of those things that I got a pretty good idea why it's there and what happened, but we won't get too far into that. Anyway, still kind of cool something I'll bring home and do something with. Oops, oh, bear skull. Yeah. Chuck that in the pack and try and whiten that up and I'm sure the wife will love it, so win-win.
Yeah, that's more what I'm looking for. It's the first good, uh, good rub I just found here. I mean, I knew there was going to be some here because I know what kind of deer are in this area, so I wasn't all that concerned about it. But I <clears throat> found some good trails, found a friggin' stellar rub. So we're just going to keep going, circle back. I don't like trudging through areas too much, especially when I already kind of know I'm going to hunt it. Good tree option, about 50 yards from that rub. All right, let's get out of here before I find too many more ticks and I cry about it. The reason I say I cry about it is because I've been bragging, <laughs> bragging this place up, like, but I haven't had any ticks on me out of the camp and out around the camp, but I think walking around in the grass is it's bound to happen. It's actually really warm out here. It's nice, but the bugs are coming, so it's good to get out here and do this stuff while while you still can, really. Um, but yeah, overall, like, pretty productive. I'm happy with it. Found found that bait barrel. Found um, a spot. I'm gonna call a deer spot for this hunting season. So probably more of an early season spot. Um, what else? Crash a bike. Not really crashed it, but like, I don't know if you can, a couple little scratches there, but uh, tipped over, crashed a drone, like, I really crashed a drone, like my first time ever crashing a drone, so, got that checked off the list now, bear skull's cool, I'm going to uh, bring that home and clean it up and probably put that on the shelf or somewhere, maybe in the camp, good day. Thanks for tagging along. We'll see you in the next one.